Aloha, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Master Paul. Happy to be connecting with you today. It is a Monday. We just completed our weekend. <clears throat> What's today's date? Let's see. Wednesday is Valentine's Day, so I guess that makes this the 12th. So thank you for joining me today. On your busy day, I always appreciate that. I know that you could be doing many other things, but I'm very happy that you chose to take some time to be with me today. Today I'll be talking about Tao Love, T-A-O, Tao Love. And I'm going to give you wisdom, guidance, and blessings with Tao Love that I hope you will find validation that it can melt your pain. Now, I'm not, I can, it can be any kind of pain. It can be physical pain, emotional pain. <clears throat> Doesn't matter. Tao Love can melt pain. And we're going to discover that today. And we'll actually do some practices with it and see if you can get some validation on your own. So I thank you all for coming. And that was stated for all those that are new, just arriving for the first time. If you're scrolling through and you'd like to watch this, would like to experience this thing called Tao Love and see if it actually dissolves your pain in your neck, your back, your shoulder, your stomach, <clears throat> maybe it's an emotional pain, then, and if you're unable to stay for this hour, then please like and subscribe and come back to my page uh, because this will be a recording afterwards and you can watch it again. For those of you that are really in a busy place and just don't have time for videos, but you're always on the go, you can follow up with my podcasts that I post about a week or so late. Uh, I download them at the end of the week from Facebook and turn them into podcasts and put them on my web page, which is listed above this video. So you can also find out more that way. <clears throat> so I look very forward to serving you in that way. And so let's go ahead and see who's joined us so far today. Aloha and welcome Phyllis Casper. Welcome Ferdy Cruz. Welcome Joanne Brown. And Dimple, aloha Cynthia. Welcome also to Susan Rossman. <coughs> uh, welcome M.A. Drade. Aloha CJ. CJ is up a little early. Imai, Imai I think, Kalani. Welcome Kristen Rojas and aloha Shanna. Thompson, Diana Victoria, welcome Kathy Arnold, welcome Dib Jolt, aloha and welcome also to Janice Crosby Smith, Lisa Zarniak, Sophia Onofrio, and Nola Curtis, welcome Aspasia, welcome also to Larissa Wood <coughs> and Lisa Carter, and Sharon Dodd, welcome Christina Thorson, aloha Vanessa. Kathy Arnold, I thought I'd mention your name, but if not, welcome. Uh, Anjali Flauta, Dean Forbes, Aloha Catherine. <laughs> and welcome to anybody else. If I missed your name, welcome. Thank you also for clicking on that share button and letting uh, the people you care about know about this live stream. So on my phone, I have this little, I'm going to try to clean my phone because it looks like I have a thumbprint on my forehead. We'll see if it's my phone or what it is. That's better. I don't like thumbprints on my forehead. Okay. <clears throat> so thank you all for joining. Um, so while we wait a few more minutes for everyone to join, let's go ahead and connect heart to heart, soul to soul. Place in our hand, soul light, soul service, hand position. We drop the left hand in front of the center, and the right hand remains pointed towards heaven. For those that are listening in for the first time, this is a mantra, and I will ask the beings of light to come and join us. <clears throat> so let us connect. Dear all layers of the divine, the Tao and the source, our beloved creator, all the committees in heaven and beyond, all beings of light serving the light side, including our beloved Jesus, beloved Mother Mary, beloved Amitofu, beloved Kuan Yin, angels, healing angels, archangels, masters and ascended masters, gurus, lamas, sifu, saints, buddhas and bodhisattvas, Our individual heavens, teams, guides, angels, and saints. We love you all, respect and honor you all, and ask you most sincerely to please join us at this time. 
and offer whatever blessings are appropriate to assist each and every one of us on our soul journey. As we work with Tao love today, <clears throat> please bless this practice to help us release our pain, whatever the source, whatever the cause. I am extremely, extremely grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Dear the Source Soul Song of Love, Peace and Harmony, transmitted to all souls and all universes, we love you, we honor you, respect you. We ask at this time that you please come. We invite all souls and all universes to chant with us love, peace, and harmony, to serve unconditionally. So for those that are new, this is a mantra, and you may join in to chant. Kristen has posted the words, and Kristen Rojas has posted the words in her uh, chat. And then also you can download this song. Uh, but now, if it's your first time, make a request silently and receive the blessing. Everybody else, please join. Lula Lula Li Lula Lula La Li Lula Lula Li Lula Lula Li Lula Lula Li Lula Oh, I wash in her ling. Oh, I turn ran Wang ling rung her musher shung. Shung I ping on the se. Xiang ai ping an he xie I love my heart and soul I love all humanity Join hearts and souls together Love, peace and harmony love peace and harmony how 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 thank you thank you thank you to the source soul song of love peace and harmony we invite all souls in all universes that have come to join in this chanting to please stay and do these practices with us i'm a little warm i'm gonna turn on my fan give me a moment Okay, one of the side effects of living in such a gorgeous place like Hawaii, we actually have to have a fan in the month of February. Today is a gorgeous day outside. I went down to the ocean with my wife for about 20 or so minutes and um, we got to see a couple whales spouting and jumping and I was very happy because it's been well over a month since I'd seen any of them. I wasn't even sure if they came this year. They were so scarce. But we were blessed to see some happy whales. So it was a big blessing. <clears throat> so thank you all for coming. Thank you for joining. So for those that are new, my name is Master Paul. And I am a certified master teacher. Trained underneath a world-renowned teacher, Dr. Master Shaw. And Dr. Master Shaw uh, is a wonderful person. And a person that is tries to do as much as he can to help humanities alleviate their suffering and suffering in all forms, pain in all forms. He's traveled around the world the last 20 or so years uh, teaching soul over matter. Heal the soul first and the mind and body will follow. And in the process of doing that, in the process of receiving higher and higher authorities, higher and higher abilities to bring miracle healing to people, he received um, higher and higher wisdom from the uh, divine and <clears throat> having grown up in China Master Sha grew up with Buddhist teachings grew up with and and came to understand Confucianism teachings uh, and also came to understand Taoism teachings learned a little bit about the other ones along the way 
<coughs> but when he checked with his, uh, his spiritual father, Master Guo, who is a world-renowned healer in China, uh, world, very well-renowned, world-renowned for curing the incurables. So this teacher, he asked him one day, Baba, Baba means father, spiritual father, Baba, um, is there really a God? Baba said, yes, there really is. It's not just Buddha. It's not just, uh, you know, the different things that are out there. There really is divine creator. <clears throat> and he asked him, Baba, is there something above God? And his master replied, yes, but I don't know what. So in the process of Master Shah becoming more awake and more aware, <coughs> he thought that the word Tao and the word source and the word God all pretty much meant the same thing. And as he received higher and higher abilities to serve humanity, to help humanity, he asked heaven, he asked the source, Tao, God, um, so what is Tao and what is Source? Is that different than God? And what was explained to him was very surprising. And the answer was, the, creation, the creator of all things, from which everything is born, <coughs> creates everything, including heaven and Mother Earth. It creates other stars. It the creator of everything creates many galaxies, many planets, in which there is life, a lot of life. Life that we are unaware of for the most part, but most likely in our lifetime we will become aware of. And he was told that that is referred to as source or Tao, T-A-O, Tao. And so he asked, you mean Taoism? They said, no, not Taoism. Taoism is a religion. Christianity is a religion. <clears throat> not a religion. Just Tao. Tao means source. Tao means the oneness from which everything is born. So some people in their mind, including even Master Shah, had great difficulty with that because how is it possible that something was above God, right? God is creator, right? And what he was told is, no, God is a being that was born like everything else from creator from original source that started as uh, a speck of energy and matter and went through the progression of experiencing life eventually becoming a piece of matter that you and i might see like a piece of sand then maybe a rock and then maybe a tree and then maybe an animal and then maybe a human and then on up to a saint or a buddha and then higher and higher and higher until God was in charge of this earth and this heaven and this experience we live in. So it's really mind shattering. It definitely will probably rattle some of you. I'm not asking you to believe it. It's simply what he has come to understand. And he had difficulty accepting that <clears throat> given his understanding as well. And he was not asked to accept it either. He just said, you know, just work with it, see what happens. And he would offer blessings at the level of God in charge of earth and heaven and humanity. And then he would offer blessings to the level of Tao. And he came to understand that there are layers of creation to the very top creator. There are layers of creation to the very top creator. We, as human beings, go through incarnations and we become more and more evolved, higher and higher and higher and higher and higher. Mother Earth is going through incarnation. She is an unconditional universal servant, gives her, her breath of her air, gives her life force of her water, gives her life force energy. Without Mother Earth, we would all be very dead. We need Mother Earth's life force energy, water, and air. She is an unconditional universal ser servant, lived about 4 billion years as far as we can tell. We live 100 years. I think she's quite a bit far more advanced than we are. <clears throat> Heaven is even more advanced than Mother Earth. Heaven 
is all the beings of light below God. And there are layers above that. So, you don't have to accept it. Uh, but do not square your head either. Set it aside in the recesses in the corner, the right and left side of your brain, and say to yourself, okay, you know, maybe it's true, maybe it's not. They don't have enough information at this point to validate it. But I'm going to just put it over there, and maybe additional information will come over the course of time that will either invalidate it or validate it. That's what I've done. That's what's worked well for me with any information I did not understand at that time. And it has worked quite well in the bigger picture. So our beloved God <coughs> is extraordinary and saves our lives on a daily basis. And the message is that there is Tao love, T-A-O, Tao love. What is Tao love? And how is it higher than, for example, God love? Well, it simply is built on frequencies. You hear about dimensions, for example, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, and so on dimensions. You think there's nothing higher than ninth dimension? Right? Everyone only really talks about from one to nine. Most humanity, that's just where their brain stops, is at the ninth dimension. Above that is God. Master Shah shares layers in the first and second. You know, it's just nothingness and and then two and three and four there is a uh, uh, plant life and mountains and rivers and streams and then um, five and six <coughs> there is um, it's in reverse excuse me um, I won't go into that now but basically there's layers that that all life goes through in its um, enlightening process and so as we reach divine level which could take millions, a couple of millions of lifetimes, even according to the information that he's received through all of his very high level wisdom and teachings, our beloved Jesuses, our beloved Buddhas, uh, Kuan Yin's, and Amitofus have had to reincarnate many, many times before they can be at the level where they're at. And they will continue to, to go higher and higher and higher. So Tao love is really a frequency of love. Is probably the easiest and best way to understand it. Tao love, just like everything, has a frequency. It comes from a specific dimension. And that dimension has a much higher frequency than our third dimension, the one we live in. So if we <coughs> add um, a very strong frequency, it tends to override the weaker ones. And if we add a good healing frequency, it will benefit us. Love is the highest frequency of all. How can I say that? Well, it's very clear. Creator of a life, the source, creator, is the highest frequency, is love. That's what we all originated from. That's what we're all going back to. So can this highest frequency, this source love, fix us? Can this source love reverse pain? Can this source love melt our pain? We're going to find out. <clears throat> In the wisdom and teachings of the nature of the universe, the nature of cause and effect, the nature of pain, there is no accidents ever. If you have pain, there is a cause. And it's not that you hit your elbow on the wall. Okay, that's not the cause. That is what created that condition of pain, but you can't blame the wall. Okay? There's always a cause that leads to an effect. And in the wisdom that Master Shah has received from direct guidance from the source, <clears throat> we are all part of a karmic web, individually and collectively. And so what melts this karma? What can melt all forms of unpleasant karma? Love. It's the highest frequency. 
everything, 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 everything is on a level. So either hotter or colder than us, higher or lower than us. It carries a higher frequency or lower frequency, a healing frequency or a unhealthy frequency. Frequency is a word that can be intermixed with um, a value. When I first read <clears throat> in Master Shah's books that love melts all blockages, it was just like right over my head. I just, I read it, and, okay, next sentence please, right? Because my heart was so closed, I completely failed to grasp the sentence. And you know what he did? You know what Master Shah did? He repeated it. Thank goodness. He repeated it in his next book that I read. Where do you think that one went? It went through this ear and right out the other one. It took about four years of reading <clears throat> Love Melts All Blockages. I've been training with this master 10 years before I start started to grasp it. <clears throat> I'm still grasping it. How is it possible that something like love, for the most part an intangible, for the most part something that you can't put your finger on, you can as best as the human level, third dimension level, the best we can do is describe it with romantic intonations. <clears throat> How is it that something that we can comprehend at that level with our mind remove pain, like serious pain? Well, the answer is we cannot very easily. We can, but not very easily do it with our third dimensional love comprehension and understanding. Really hard to accomplish. We can, however, accomplish melting pain with a much higher layer of love. God's love, for example. God's love, how did God get to where it's God's love? Not Jesus's love, not Buddha's love, not your love or my love, God's love. Would you agree that that's a higher love? How do we comprehend that with our limited mind? <clears throat> the miracles that we witness, all of us have witnessed some miracles. You wouldn't be watching if you hadn't. Many of you have received blessings and discomforts went away, sometimes permanently, sometimes temporarily. And these are sometimes uh, they wake us up and sometimes we just ignore it and come back and complain some more. Well, it worked, but it only worked two days. That happens. So when we're dealing with Tao love, the thing I want you most to comprehend <coughs> is that it is not the regular love you think you understand. It is the purity from which you were created. Love. That unconditional, I love you unconditionally, there's nothing you can ever do to disappoint me, kind of love. The kind of love that a mother has for a newborn child. The nothing you could ever do to disappoint me, love. That kind of high level of purity. And then take that times a million. That's Tao love. So what we're going to do is instead of me trying to explain it, we're going to experience it. We have uh, 35 or 36 people that have joined now. I'm going to acknowledge some of those newer folks that have joined. And we're, you're going to receive a Tao love transmission. We're going to use it together to transform your pain. So welcome Pat, JD, Aloha. Welcome Erica Rimmer. Welcome also to Angie Diacomo. Welcome Robin Toth, Lisa Patterson. Welcome also to Nikki Davis, Lydia Lali. Aloha and welcome. Crystal, Sherry White, Elizabeth Dorago. Gina Vittoria, welcome. Aloha, Callie Jan. Welcome, Trina Jeffrey. Welcome, Sherry White. <coughs> and anybody else, have I missed you? Forgive me. Get, drink some water here. So for the new people, this is Master Shah. And he is a uh, world-renowned miracle healer who cannot make enough of himself 
to heal all 7 billion of us. So what he has done is he's transmitted power into objects, books, things, calligraphies, things of that nature. <clears throat> so if you're new and you're wondering, well, does this stuff really work? We're going to find out today. We're going to find out right now. I have to take a minute to explain to you what you're going to receive if you wish to receive it. <coughs> As a... <coughs> Excuse me. Deeply apologize coughing in your ear. You just ate a little bit and something uh, doesn't want to stay down. Um, so this teacher, Master Shah, has indicated, you know, he's, he's with millions of people. So it's not even questionable. You can just do your homework if you don't believe it. And so Master Shah has transmitted power into many things, including the book that I'm about to offer a blessing to you. As a certified master teacher, one of the highest levels of teachers in his organization, I have received the authority to read this transmission in the book and deliver it to you. You will receive today, if you wish to receive it, a Tao Love Soul, Mind, and Body Golden Light Ball Jindan. It's called Light Ball, Energy Ball. For those with third eye, I know Kristen, uh, um, Kathleen O'Shea is watching. Uh, she has amazing third eye. There might be a few other of you that have good third eye. Please share what it is you see when I transmit this. Not for me. I know what happens. For the others that are new, that are unsure what this is and does it really work. <coughs> and then we're going to practice with this because if you choose to receive this uh, transmission, then you will be receiving a permanent part of your soul, kind of like new software added to your soul, a golden light ball of the highest frequency of the source love. And this highest frequency, when activated and used to clear a pain body blockage that you may be experiencing right now, could bring significant benefits. We're going to measure. Okay. So everybody choose your condition physical pain preferably especially if you're new could be headache head, uh, body ache hip ache back ache stomach ache um, long standing short standing is irrelevant give it a number give it a number we're going to do this practice i want to do it about 15 minutes i want to give it a good long blessing so that after 15 minutes you can decide for yourself can Tao love melt pain? Can Tao love bring healing to me? <clears throat> Tao love is not limited to today's webcast. If you decide to receive this today, you can use this transmission to bless your best friend. Dear my Tao love transmission, please turn on. Please offer my best friend a blessing uh, from the breakup of her relationship example right you can offer a blessing to your children to your parents because this transmission has unconditional love it can serve unconditionally you'll learn how to do that today okay <clears throat> welcome Edna welcome Heather McNee and Maria Crispy welcome also to uh, Brajishwar and Angela Berry thank you for coming thank you also for hitting the share button letting other people know about this so this transmission, when we go to use it, we will do a forgiveness practice for the pain area of pain request. So choose your area of pain request. Give it a number. Uh, it's a 5 on a 10 scale. You know, it's a 12 on a 10 scale. How bad is your pain, right? <clears throat> you don't need to report it now. But at the end, I want you to report the results. This is the condition. My pain is a 6 on a 10 scale. And then after the blessing, it hasn't changed. Or after the blessing, it's now a 1 on a 10 scale. Whatever the truth is, okay? And this is for you, not for me. This is for all those that watch this after the fact. So that you understand the value of Tao love. Master Shah cannot uh, heal all 7 billion people. So he put transmissions into things so that we could self-heal. <coughs> I'm so sorry. So I see somebody saying, many years of fibromyalgia. Well, very difficult condition. You have to be realistic in the results, but give it a real number. 
choose a specific area for your Tao love to work on. Maybe it's um, exhaustion. Maybe it's joint pain in your knees specifically. Ask it to focus on a specific area because fibromyalgia tends to be whole body and it's not so easy to get a result in 15 minutes. That's very high level uh, blockages. Okay, so try to narrow it down. Um, okay, welcome Tasha James. Welcome also to uh, anybody else I may have missed. And uh, Christina Strachan. Um, yes, you can call your loved ones souls if you wish. Um, I can only deliver to those that are watching, but you can ask your transmission to bless a loved one at the same time you are receiving the blessing. So, if you wish to receive, do not type in, I want to receive. Just tell heaven, I'm just going to deliver. If you are not, uh, do not wish to receive this transmission, just say, no, thank you. Because you can always get this book on your own. It's Dao Song Dao Dance and you can scroll to page 147 and download it to your, to your own self by yourself. This is if you wish to receive it, okay? Welcome Silvana, welcome Andrea. <coughs> Prepare. Dear Divine Dao Source, Dear Master Shah, thank you for the opportunity to serve. Through the authorities Master Shah has transmitted to us Master Teachers, transmission from this book to all of those watching, at this time, all of those who watch in the future, all of those who listen on podcast, as appropriate, prepare to receive. If you do not wish to receive, just say, no, thank you, I'm not ready. Prepare. Dao order. Dao golden light ball and golden liquid spring of Dao love. Soul, mind, body, transplant. To everyone watching now, everyone who watches this in the future, all those on podcast, as appropriate. Those with third eye, please watch. I will ask for your sharing. Transmission! Divine order, turn on 24-7. Transmission, divine order, join as one in the Mingmen. Transmission. Hey, 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 hey. How, 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 you are all extremely, extremely blessed. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> so I will wait for those who have uh, seen anything or experienced anything to post. I'm going to read a little bit. We'll read those posts and then we're going to practice. So in Master Shah's book, after he delivers this, he states, the Tao Love soul transplant is the soul of Tao Love. Tao Love mind transplant is the consciousness of Tao Love. Tao Love body transplant is the energy and tiny matter of Tao Love. Each one is a huge golden light being. Huge. You have no idea. Wait till you see the readings. Dao Love Soul Mind Body Transplants are the Shen Qi and Jing, which is soul, heart, mind, energy, and matter, of the Source Love. It carries the energies, the frequencies of the Source Love brought down into your body, connected to your soul. Congratulations. Each of you received these three treasures. Wow, I didn't realize this. He said, each of, you, each of these three treasures is more than 1,000 feet high and more than 200 feet wide. It usually takes two or three days for them to shrink to adapt to your body. After shrinking, their permanent size is still two to three times bigger than your body. So if somebody had an aura, can see aura, they would see much bigger golden aura around you because of these transmissions. You are extremely blessed. Every reader is extremely blessed. Yeah, no kidding. And here's the thing. He's such an amazing being, such an unconditional servant. That's just one transmission. He has 13 of those in this book. In all of his books, he puts free healing blessings like this. You're absolutely uh, uh, nuts if you understand this and you don't want to go and get a bunch of his books because he has so many of these kinds of light balls transmitted. Who wouldn't want to have those on their soul? Just brilliant. Okay, let's see what people are saying. <clears throat> so, 
So very happy and grateful. Big sigh, deep relief. Welcome, Pandur. Uh, thank you, says Shelley. Uh, Phyllis felt it in her crown, saw green and pink light. Uh, Jamial Brown, welcome, Jamial. Welcome, Arabelle. Um, Catherine O'Shea says, Wow, I asked for her back and she felt a big tingle all over her body as I read the order when you said transmission she felt a huge surge of energy and light and it shook her whole body uh, Brenda saw my aura expand as I sent this blessing yeah it's, it's, it's I'm so blessed to be able to deliver these I definitely get blessings just in the delivery process <clears throat> Phyllis says shoulder pain down to a four from a six we haven't even practiced yet this is just the delivery. <clears throat> Golden energy ball then blasts off. Big as the Tao. Um, Catherine says the light energy was so powerful she couldn't open her eyes for a few seconds. Uh, aura has increased, says Raja Shah. Uh, Trinity uh, saw massive golden light balls coming down and going splash into the auric field, including her wand she was holding. Lisa perked up. Yeah, very, very generous. So thank you for those sharings. Very important for you to know of each other's sharings and what you experienced physically, what you saw. Now we practice. So take note of your pain. If you don't have any physical body pain, maybe you have emotional pain, choose that, okay? <clears throat> choose something ideally that is measurable. We're going to practice for well, at least 10 minutes, maybe longer. So how do we practice? We employ the four powers. We place our hands just like this like a prayer position but we use a hand mudra position called the solite arrow position we drop the left hand in front of the heart center right hand remain pointed towards heaven so kathy said she saw a golden and rainbow lightning bolts streaming down to everyone amazing beautiful so let us close our eyes and we're going to connect to this treasure many of you have already received multiple treasures so listen to how i state this because you can turn them all on with one very simple sentence so repeat after me. Dear all my downloads and treasures, I love you, honor you, deeply appreciate you. Can you please turn on? See? Simple. <coughs> if you read some of his books, you might have 20, 30, 40 treasures transmitted to your body. All my downloads and treasures. Can you please turn on? Okay. Much better to have 20, 30, 40 of these blessing the pain area than just one. That's much higher condensed frequencies. Thou love carries very high frequencies. <clears throat> so repeat. Dear the soul of my Tao love, golden light ball, golden liquid spring transmission, I deeply love you, honor you, and appreciate you. Could you offer a healing blessing as appropriate to my area of request and then state your area of request my knee my shoulder my neck my back whatever okay pay attention what is your pain level i am extremely grateful <clears throat> now remember there are outer souls inner souls always ask for additional love dear god dear the source dear all the beings of light that have come to this practice today I love you, love you, love you. Send them your love. Love you, honor you, deeply respect you. I ask most humbly from my heart, if you would please assist in this blessing as appropriate. I am beyond grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <coughs> now, you also have a specific area you've requested. So in this specific area, we must acknowledge that it's called an inner soul. Let's say it was the shoulder. Do the soul of my, state your area, shoulder, whatever it is. I love you. You do a great job for me, helping me move my body, helping me have energy. You do a great job for me being a better person. You have the power to heal yourself. Do a good job thank you yeah I'm my uh, I'm receiving some some kickback from that blast <laughs> cleared so much crud it's running through my body now so that's why my throat's a little scratchy and itchy it'll clear <clears throat> uh, 
And now we do a forgiveness. Very important. The most important. You don't do forgiveness, you could get half the result. You do deep forgiveness, far superior result. If comfortable, continue to repeat. Dear all souls of humanity, all souls in all time, if I or my ancestors have harmed you, caused suffering for you, made significant mistakes, mistreated you in such a way that it ended up with you suffering in the same area as I am suffering in. From my heart and soul, I sincerely, sincerely apologize. Deeply apologize. Please forgive me. Please forgive my ancestors. I would not want anybody to suffer in this way. But if I have, or my ancestors have caused the same kind of suffering, please forgive me. Thank you. <clears throat> so now we chant, Tao love. From your heart, place one palm on your heart center, one palm on your lower abdomen. <clears throat> we will chant for 10 minutes straight. Okay? And I will vacillate between loud and silent chant. I will vacillate uh, fast and slow chant. Continue to visualize things clearing in that area. Light, frequency, heavens, love, Tao, source, love, coming to that area. Let us chant together. <coughs> Tao, love, Tao, love. Da love. If you can reach your pain area with one of your hands, then do so. Where your hand goes, energy flows. If you cannot reach there, just keep your hand on your heart. Da love. Da love. Da love. <coughs> da. Dao love, Dao love, Dao love, Dao love, Dao love, Feel and notice the area <coughs> melting. The discomfort in the area is releasing. There is exceedingly high frequencies orchestrating a release in this area. Tao love, Tao love, Tao love, Tao love. Tao love melts all blockages. Tao love melts all blockages. Thou love melts my 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 blockages. Thou love, thou love, thou love, thou love. Thou love, 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 thou love melts my blockages. Thou love melts my blockages. Thou love melts my blockages. <coughs> Thou love melts my blockages. I'm getting the message that people need to move. So if you can, stand up and gently let your body move you. Do not move your body. Allow your body to move you. Just continue to chant. 
and all love melts my blockages. <clears throat> your body may move your arm or your hips or some part of your body in a way that will help you to release. Thou love melts my blockages. 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 Gently tap the area of pain or your message sensor. Thou love, thou love, thou love. Tune in to the source creator's love. Thou love, thou love, thou love. <coughs> Welcome, Amanda. Thou love, thou love, thou love, thou love. Thou love, 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 melts my blockages. Thou love melts my blockages. Thou love melts my blockages. <clears throat> five minutes. We still have five minutes to go. Thou love melts my blockages. Thou love melts my blockages. Please repeat, dear the soul of my Tao love, golden light bulb, golden liquid spring, Jindan, please radiate your Tao love to all of the souls that I and my ancestors have harmed that is the source of this pain that I am experiencing. <clears throat> Please bless them with your highest love frequency. Now let us shower all of them with this Tao love as appropriate. Tao love, Tao love, Tao love, Tao love, Tao love. Keep your eyes closed, focus, visualize the Tao Love golden light ball. It's completely surrounding your body. They're so huge and it's radiating the highest source love to all of those souls that you or your ancestors may have harmed that has created the pain in your arm or your back or wherever it's at. It's simply karma, cause and effect. Let us bless them. Thou love, <clears throat> thou love, thou love, thou love, thou love, thou love. Melt my pain, melt my pain. Thou love melts their pain. Thou love melts their pain. Remember, we're blessing them now. 
Tao love melts their pain. 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 Tao love. Tao love. Tao love. Tao love. Tao love blesses them. Tao love blesses them. Tao love blesses them. See the extraordinary light radiating to them. To me, it looks like white and golden and pink radiating to all of those souls that we may have harmed. And this harm has come to us to remind us it has brought us aspects of our pain. Let us bless them and their soul journey because we may have created this suffering in the first place. <clears throat> Thou love blesses them 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 thou love 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 Thou love, 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 Silently chant, Thou love, Thou love. I will describe what I am seeing. So at this time, <clears throat> all of those souls that have been invited are surrounded by a beautiful golden orb. And it is radiating to them, softening their anger, softening their despair and their hurt softening their revenge thinking <clears throat> this Tao love is giving them wisdom teaching them how to open their heart and how to forgive remember our ancestors may have chopped their back in wartime may have cut their head for those that have significant headaches or even necks we may have made some very unpleasant mistakes. We may have harmed animals' bodies, backs, legs, necks. We don't know what that karma is. We just know that if it has been with us, we need to take some responsibility. <clears throat> and so these souls, they get lost. They don't always want to forgive because they've been hurt so deeply. We send them the greatest love. Thou love, thou love, thou love, thou love. Let's ask for forgiveness one more time. Dear all of these beautiful souls, if I or my ancestors have made such horrible, unpleasant mistakes from my heart and soul, I sincerely, sincerely apologize. I would never do anything like that to anybody now. I have definitely grown and learned my lessons. I ask your unconditional forgiveness so that I can be healthy and happy. And in return, I promise to help others to be healthier and happier. I am so grateful for the opportunity to receive your forgiveness. One more minute. Thou love, thou love, <coughs> thou love, Thou love, thou love, thou love, thou love, thou love. And let us bow our heads to our source creator, to the golden light ball of Tao love 
that is now a permanent part of your body. Let us bow our heads to all of those souls that have forgiven us and all the ones that have not forgiven us. We must do more practice. You may have experienced amazing results. You may have experienced no result. No result does not mean it did not work. No result means that the karma is very high. So you must do deeper forgiveness and practice a lot more. How, 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 thank you, thank you, thank you. All souls respectfully return. How, <clears throat> okay. So feel free to share what your experience was with this. In your sharing, please define. This was my pain level before. For the condition, I want to know what the condition was. I had back pain, I had neck pain, I had headache, I had stomach ache, whatever. It, this was the pain level before. Now this is the pain level, okay? Measure. What did we do? <clears throat> from a minimum 2,000 miles away, I read words from a book. I told you that you received the transmission. You don't know that for sure. It's just words from a book. And yet, if somebody had a pain that was an 8 and it went down to a 2, how can that happen from simply chanting Tao Love? Highly unlikely. This is designed to change your thinking so that you understand what kind of tools Master Shah has left in his books. What kind of healing is available to us every moment if we just do the practice. So I wait for your sharing. Kathy Arnold says green and tinges of pinks <clears throat> in the heart center. That's what she sees. Welcome, Amatma. Uh, Kristen says, thank you, dear Master Paul, for this boost of Tao love. I have been going through significant emotional suffering, so I ask for... <clears throat> a, a message center blessing and balancing of heat and emotions. When she received the boost and during the practice, she experienced great release and softening in her message center. Experienced heart opening where her heart closed because of the emotional pain. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> Lisa Zarniak, so much exhaustion, she feels like she has energy now. Yeah, it takes a great deal of energy to hold on to pain. A lot more fun, <laughs> dancing in Tao Love. How many of you got up and moved? How many of you did dancing, soul dancing, body movement, right? That was the message. Get up and do body movement. I tell you, that's one of the best therapies. Put on love, peace, and harmony music. Turn on your transmissions. Just let your body move you. It's not forced dance. It's your body, your soul moves you. Very different. Your soul knows exactly where and how to move you. Your soul might move you to the floor and in contortions, but it knows how to release the blockages. <clears throat> uh, Phyllis says she, her left shoulder pain was a 7 and now it's down to a 2 and her scratchy voice cleared. Amazing! Let us bow our heads in gratitude. Thank you, the Tao Source. Thank you, the golden uh, light ball of Tao Love. You've all received this transmission now. You have no idea. I'm trying to get you the understanding of the idea of how powerful this is. Um, you're very welcome. Welcome, Rohan. Brenda says, thank you, Master Paul. She has trigeminal neuralgia. Her pain level was at a 5 before this. <clears throat> now it's down to a 2. Lots of yawning and green and pink colors. Beautiful. Thank you. Yeah, that's, that's, a, that's a lot. It's not easy, Brenda. So, um, you may want to look at getting a blessing for that, Brenda. A uh, higher level one transmission. Okay, Trina, Jeffrey, so much gratitude. <clears throat> Lisa Zarniak, thank you. You're welcome. Shelly says, beautiful practice. Her soul was jumping with joy when we served the other souls that had been damaged, uh, possibly damaged by us or our ancestors in this other lifetime. Thank you. And Kristen said she enjoyed the soul dancing as well. Uh, not much change in her pain. I know you had a thumb pain. Okay. And uh, Danta, welcome. I don't know if you've been watching this whole time. But if you hadn't, I reckon to go back. So, Tao love is, a, is in you, all those that you chose to receive. Use it. Use it to serve yourself. Use it to serve others. Remember to follow the pattern of this practice. 
Offer Tao love to those that had been harmed by us or our ancestors for that same condition. <clears throat> because it is carrying virtue. It carries very high virtue and very high frequency. And when we move outside of ourselves and we offer blessings to others, that's when we're really, that's when we get it. Okay. Uh, and Braja Shwa said, there was no pain he enjoyed for the message center and did body movements. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Divine Tao Source and Master Shah. Um, Kathy said she saw my Buddha behind me laughing joyously and Kuan Yuma's dancing behind me on the wall. So her third eye saw their souls dancing. Wonderful. <coughs> Diana feels the blessings and blockages are much related to her ancestors. Yes. Um, yeah, probably, Kristen. Probably. And Dean Forbes, um, his shortness of breath went from a seven down to a three and got him up and dancing in the room. Excellent. Wonderful. And Dimple, uh, welcome. Let's see who else? Nola Curtis, she was coughing at the start of today's session, but once she started chanting, her coughing stopped. Her palms were very warm and golden light. Mm -hmm. Heather said she seen beautiful golden light with crystallized light and diamond symbol in the heart. Had tummy bloated was a six, now it's a three. Her thumb was a nine, and now there is no pain. Thank you, Tao Love. Yeah, beautiful. Great sharing. Great sharing. <clears throat> Validation. Okay? This is not just some guy on the other end of the telephone talking. It has to do with the blessing you receive. If you don't know who Master Shah is, you need to find out more. Um, and need to get his books. You need to get, you know, the calligraphies. I do extraordinary blessings myself, so if any of you want direct uh, blessings to re release some of these blessings, these, sometimes you do these blessings, they come back. You do blessings again, they come back, you know, like on your own. That's a basically means you have some pretty high level stuff going on. That's when you need a master teacher like myself. So if any of you are watching this for the first time and you would just like to be done with it, uh, like the trigeminal, um, then contact me and we'll see what we can do to serve you. Of course, there's a small honor fee for that but it's worth being rid of it. So. <clears throat> so thank you for joining me today. Thank you for uh, uh, sharing and letting other people know about these live streams. Love you, love you, love you. Thank you, thank you, thank you to all the beings of light who have come. We're extremely grateful. Please respectfully return. Gong song, gong song, gong song. Bye-bye, everybody. We'll see you soon. <clears throat>